Beth from Yellowstone is a Brit? It's true. Kelly Riley has paid her dues and it's paying off. Here's a look back at her glorious glow up. Kelly Riley realized she wanted to be an actress as a teen thanks to her drama teacher at Tolworth Girls School in Kingston, England, who introduced her to the world of acting. Riley told the Evening Standard, "...he put me in his wife's drama group and suddenly I was reading Chekhov and Shakespeare. My world suddenly became much more exciting." In the interview with the Evening Standard, Riley, who was raised in Surrey, described her young self as shy and not interested in schoolwork, adding that she wasn't very academic. Once she discovered acting and developed her skills, a new world opened up for the actress, who grew up with non-actor parents. Her father served as a police officer for over two decades, Riley told The Guardian, and her mother was a hospital receptionist, according to Express. Before Kelly Riley discovered her love and talent for acting, she loved working with horses and thought she'd have a future in it. As she explained to The Evening Standard, most days after school she'd ride horses and help care for them at a stable. She told the newspaper, "...I couldn't afford a horse, but I kind of adopted one and spent a lot of time with him. It was an obsession, and if I hadn't discovered acting, I wouldn't be here talking to you." In an interview with a Texas ABC affiliate, Riley went into more detail about her horse riding days and said she worked as a groom at a polo club and typically exercised the horses there, presumably in preparation for competitions. While Riley doesn't do a lot of riding on Yellowstone, she takes advantage of downtime while shooting on location in Montana to go horseback riding, according to her Instagram. She told Parade Magazine, "...it's always been where I get my head screwed back on, just being in nature and being on horses." When Kelly Riley fell in love with acting and theater, she knew she had to pursue it professionally. At 16, she left home and landed a few theater roles before making her TV debut on Prime Suspect, a 90s British TV series starring veteran actress Helen Mirren. If it wasn't for Mirren, Riley doesn't think she would have made it through, telling the Daily Mail. She was incredibly supportive with a great sense of humor. Helen reckons that to be an actor, you have to experience life rather than disappear inside a drama school for three years. So I took her advice and carried on acting. Years later, in 2009, she'd star as Anna Travis in Above Suspicion, another crime thriller TV series from the creator of Prime Suspect. Riley, who worked as a waitress as she auditioned, told the Daily Mail that her dad, a retired cop, was happy to see her playing a police detective. He even came on set to help her in her role as a detective constable. Riley said in an interview, "...the chance to see me playing not only someone decent but somebody in the same profession as he was in delights him." At age 26, Kelly Riley received a Laurence Olivier Theatre Award nomination in 2004, making her the youngest actor to receive such an honor. Riley received the nomination after starring in After Miss Julie in London's West End in 2003. Before the play opened, Riley spoke to The Independent and said she was excited about the opportunity to be a part of the production. "...it's amazing. There are so few roles like this for women my age. It's a fantastic playground to be in. I'm aware every day of what an amazing opportunity this is for me." This nomination surely opened up the doors for Riley and helped her make a name for herself in the film world. In 2005, Kelly Riley played Caroline in Pride and Prejudice based on the Jane Austen novel. After working steadily in TV and movies the next few years, she began showing up on screen alongside big movie stars like Denzel Washington in Flight and Robert Downey Jr. and Jude Law in the Sherlock Holmes franchise. All those roles eventually led her to play Beth Dutton in Yellowstone, a drama centered around a ranching family in Montana which premiered in 2018, also starring veteran actor Kevin Costner. You look good in neon. Who doesn't? In an interview with Elle, Riley said that although she had never played a character like Beth before, she was up for the challenge almost immediately. She told the magazine, "...it was just something about her that was so powerful and broken and human. Every single line of hers in that first pilot I read, I couldn't believe what I was reading." Kelly Riley has lived out plenty of romances on screen, and she's living one out in real life, too. Though there's not a ton of information out there about Riley's relationship with financier Kyle Bauer, we know they wed in England in 2012 after meeting that same year, according to Parade magazine. When asked by The Guardian in 2011 what she does in her free time, Riley shared a few details about Bauer. Riley mentioned that at the time, Bauer lived in New York and she split up her time between New York and England, adding, "...I'm not saying any more about him except that he's not an actor, not in the business." In 2018, Riley shared a rare glimpse of her personal life on Instagram with a photo of Bauer and their dog, presumably out on location in Montana for Yellowstone. In the caption, she wrote, "...out west again with my loves." Kelly Riley never chooses the same role twice. She's always looking for acting roles that challenge her, even after two decades in the industry. 
In an interview with Looper, Riley said since she's played the role of Beth Dutton in Yellowstone, she's received scripts for Beth type characters. She explained, Obviously, I play Beth and people like it, so I'm inundated with very feisty, strong, violent type women. I don't want to play that again. Look at you with your cat teeth and your spray tan. Get out of my office. For future roles, Riley wants something that takes her, quote, into different waters. What is she looking for in future roles? She told Looper, I never really know what that is until I read it. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite actors are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.